The power of persistence, what it means to stand as a testament. Hello, everyone. Welcome back to our channel, where we dive into the beautiful intricacies of the English language. Today, we're exploring a fascinating phrase that's not only rich in meaning but also powerful in its implications. Stand as a testament. Understanding this phrase can unlock new levels of comprehension and expression in English, so let's get started. Stand as a testament combines two key concepts, stand and testament. To stand in this context means to remain firm or endure over time. A testament is something that serves as evidence or proof of something's existence or truth. When we put these words together, the phrase, stand as a testament, refers to something that acts as enduring proof or a lasting symbol of a particular quality, achievement, or truth. To truly grasp how, stand as a testament, enriches language, let's look at some examples. 1. Historical monuments. The ancient ruins stand as a testament to the civilization's architectural ingenuity. 2. Personal achievements. Her successful career stands as a testament to her hard work and determination. 3. Cultural heritage. This museum stands as a testament to the rich cultural history of the region. In each of these examples, the phrase highlights how certain things or achievements can symbolize much larger concepts or values enduring through time. Incorporating, stand as a testament, into your own English conversations or writing can add depth and nuance. It's particularly useful when you want to emphasize the significance of something's impact or value, draw attention to the enduring qualities of an achievement or symbol, express admiration for the resilience or lasting nature of something. Remember, Using such phrases not only enhances your language skills but also helps you convey complex ideas more effectively. Stand as a testament is a powerful expression that goes beyond mere words, encapsulating the essence of endurance, proof, and significance. We hope this exploration has illuminated its meaning and inspired you to incorporate it into your own English usage. Thanks for joining us today, and as always, keep practicing and exploring the depths of the English language. Until next time, happy learning!